Level is just too advanced, the bezel is Tiffany stamp, no grip on my hand. I know that I came with the slide from left to right, but now I don't want to dance. Today with just me at the gym. I didn't have time to come back on and tell y'all what I was going to do and check in. Oh, it's been a good day. It's been a good day. I just got to get my mind prepared and ready for what's to be alone for like at least a month. Like away from friends, away from people. Like I just want to be alone for a while. Like everybody's energy is like irritating me. You look so nice, baby. <laughs> you so pretty. Oh my feet. Um, the game was good. The game was good. They ended up winning. I showed y'all that. Great rising, great rising. What up to my dogs? I am Lee Wantalia, also known as Lily or Truly, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new, and hey to my babies if you are true. Okay, you guys, so my camera um, ran out of memory that fast, but it's Wednesday morning. I haven't had a morning at home alone so long. I'm so excited. So today, I want to do several things and I already kind of started my day. I already had like a cup of coffee or whatever, but um, I have so much I want to do today. I'm like getting overwhelmed with joy. So it's 1028. I just finished editing the vlog and it's uploading right now. And then I just came from pulling out all of my journals. Well, not all, but some of them. So I pulled out a lot of my journals. These are all journals that I got a lot of information and knowledge in um, that I've just been writing out over the years. So this is my gratitude journal right here. And I needed to pull this out because I told y'all on my last vlog that I was going to be starting back up right now my gratitude journal. So I am, girl, I really want to hoard <laughs> I gotta take this shit out of my journal. I gotta get a whole new journal. Look. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, anyway, so we're gonna cross that out. But I love this journal, so I'm definitely gonna be still using it. This is like a planner, and then this is like another type of planner that I can use. So it's work hard, play hard. But I told y'all, it's time to go hard. I've been off work for a whole, like, year. I feel like I haven't had not one business except for when I launched um, Pocketbook University in March and I also did Paint and Champagne in March. So um, that was the only thing that I did. And I want to add on to those. I want to um, continue on with the money heist, you know, get into the bag. And I want, I just want to continue on with the money heist and giving you guys the knowledge that you want. I want to structure everything and get everything together. So, you know, it's just time to get in grind mode and I'm excited about it. So I feel like I've got a little boost because Vlogmas has been so fun and it's been pushing me to like meet one of my goals. My goal is to meet 100K um, and I feel like I'm going to make it. I don't know if I'm going to make it by the end of the month, Y'all know vlog channels grow relatively slow, but I feel like if I work on putting out new content or just constantly, consistently putting out content, that it'll continue to grow. So we just gonna wish for the best. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna prepare for the prepare for the worst, but plan for the best. Plan for the best, prepare for the worst. Something like that. So, anyways, um, I'm uploading today's vlog and about i just got through making the christmas list for my kids because i got them a couple of things on a list but i was i just have to make a list for myself because i've been so busy i need to know exactly what else i need to get them because it's time to start putting shit under the tree 
um also gotta you know my mom my dad my sister shit like that so i'm really not worried about adults this year honestly and truly because when i say i've been there for people all freaking year and it's just like y'all it's kind of been christmas for y'all all year i just really want to worry about me and my kids and that's just totally honest i really just want to worry about me and my kids and yeah so that's what i'm doing this morning the coffee got me kind of hyper and oh i want to deep clean my bathroom so these are to-do lists for the weekend so december 14 2022 making a to-do list and this is gonna be for the whole weekend so deep clean house because my floors need mop rear bed deep clean house that's bathrooms, toilets, all of that. My stuff is better and organized, so that makes me happy. And then I'm gonna figure out if I can fix my stools. Oh, I need to get the cat uh, cat house for Christmas because they scratching my shit. And um, it was something else I needed to do. Oh, set up gym. Set up the gym in my garage. And what else? It was something else. I actually need to plan out True Talk TV. Like, for real, for real. And... Da -da 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 -da, I can't remember right now. But other than that, I'm going to just keep my morning started. Um, keep up the, the pace with this. And finish editing. And turn on some fucking vlogs. I haven't watched no vlogs in I don't know how long. It's raining, so I can't take Mr. Man out right now. So, yeah, I just wanted to check in and say good morning because, um, yeah. <laughs> so, I'll be back. gratitude journal i just want to read y'all the verse that's at the top of the page and it is matthew 5 8 so it says blessed are the pure of heart for they shall see god and this whole journal entry this morning is about me um just being grateful that god has granted me the ability the ability to change to seek change and to you know, help bring change into the lives of others, especially my family and especially those who I love. And I'm just decreeing and declaring certain things over my life. And as I got to the bottom of my journal entry today, I just started to call things over my life. And, and one of the things that I wanted to call over my life was healing. And I said that I call healing over my body, my heart, my mind, and my spirit as I enter into 2023. I have forgiveness in my heart as I want my God to forgive me. And that made me think about you guys because a lot of us, we, we want to be forgiven. We want to be more lighthearted. We want to be more pleasant. We want to be more um, aligned. But the key to that is, one of the keys to that is forgiveness. And I think that that is very, very important. And I know that's something that I've struggled with. And I constantly struggle with. Like, when you do something to me, I think if I have you in a certain place in my heart, then yeah, I forgive you to a certain extent. But I've always been the type to kind of hold grudges. Um... And I want to heal that part of me because 
sometimes you just can't judge people for what they do not know. Like ignorance is the act of not knowing, right? So you can't all the time judge people for what they do not know because some people are just ignorant to shit and they have to go through life lessons in order to learn in order to grow and you can't expect people to always match your level of knowledge if that makes sense so knowing that i've always kind of given people the benefit of the doubt but then i kind of got to this part too where it's just like i'm not giving nobody the benefit of the doubt and that's what i said going into 2023 that's just exactly how i am but i wanted to come and give y'all that message as i entry as i make this entry into my journal today that forgiveness is what helps you get to that lightheartedness and going into 2023 that is definitely one of my goals. A key thing for me is to practice forgiving. Forgiving those that don't know what they've done. Forgiving those who knowingly know what they've done. And forgiving those who I can't change. Because we can't change people. People have to change for themselves. So it doesn't matter. Coworkers, friends, relationship, family, whatever. You know, you can forgive and still let go. So, let me get back. <laughs> Y'all, what the fuck, bro? For the anxiety, the stress of not knowing who to trust. Ooh, hey, babies. So I'm checking in. It is three something, and I'm getting ready to go get Bryce and get my mind. And today, I think um, we're just gonna eat some rib and loin, which is some barbecue, because I'm tired. I'm not finna cook. And if y'all remember me saying it's been raining all freaking day, like it's been raining all day and it's just been like gloomy and the weather is like relaxing remember i was just such in a hyper happy ass mood earlier and then i got stressed out <laughs> not stretched out but stressed out so uh, i'm gonna throw on some shoes go get something to eat get these kids go have to get something to drink and come back i did get a lot of work done I edited three videos, so that's good. And I also did my gratitude journal. So, yeah, I'm, I feel good, but baby, whatever. So, let me get going. Get my ass in this car. I'll be back. Just got home from getting the kids. This one pepper. And I got this package. Y'all, I ordered this. I already know what it is. I ordered it like a month ago. Maybe even longer. H&M gave me a whole coupon code to get money off my next order because they was like they sorry for the delay but it ain't nothing but a roll is this roll y'all know i'm addicted to roll and you never have too many so i got this one in this cute gray color i thought it was black but it's like a smoky gray and it's so cute. Oh my goodness. I got it because it looks like a Givenchy print. Ooh. Now this is a robe. It looks like a Givenchy print. I like it. I like it too. You like my new robe? You ain't listening to nothing nobody's saying. You like my new robe? <laughs> Anyways, I'm finna let ice out and fix our food. This is cute. I guess, 
I wouldn't say it was worth the wait, but it was worth the wait. I like it. I like it. Picasso. Mama. All right. Let me get him out of here because he finna go crazy. We finna get ready to eat, so. I don't like this. Anymore. It's still raining, so I'm finna just have to let him, like, go out the front. I'm gonna have to stand on the porch. So I'll be back. All right, babies, it's, it's later. Um, it's 8.23, actually, and I almost forgot that I had to run to Target to get Bryce a little sweater and something for his uh, friends tomorrow at school. They're having a little ugly, not a, I keep wanting to say ugly Christmas sweater party. They having a little party. So I'm gonna run to the um, Target real quick and get him something to take to school because he can't be the only one not bringing nothing. So my videos is up. I've been working all day. I've been doing research. It's gonna be a good year. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they literally only got this right here. <laughs> like, Target, what the freak is going on? Like, I don't know. But I'm gonna see what's on this list. I'll be back. I totally came in here for um, snacks for Bryce, but look at this wire basket y'all to go under my floating shelf in the living room to keep my blanket in it's gonna look so cute this chair it's cute but i can't find the price like crazy but i like this Oh, the tag was happy right here. They done ripped it off. Let me see how much the ottoman is, and then I can come judge the price. You know what? basket over there already and girl it's cute and all i got was right this shirt some chips and um the pineapple and this is my amazon package i ordered the cerave hydrate and cleanser soap bars for my body because y'all know i got dry skin so i feel like i needed some good soap for my body before my body wash so i ordered this for my body for in the shower so that was that. And I don't think I showed y'all. I had tried one of them perfumes that they be talking about on TikTok. Them little Arabian perfumes. And so I ordered this one. And it comes like this. And this smells good. It's more of an oil. It smells good, but it's just, it ain't, it ain't all uh, what they be cracking up to be. I feel like for me, I'll use this as a base for my perfumes because it is kind of strong. But I would use this as a base for my fragrances so yeah this is the box and this the bottle if i didn't show y'all and i have it listed on my amazon store the soap in this y'all make sure y'all go shop my amazon store for it and other than that i'm gonna get ready to straighten up for the night and call it a night because i gotta get up early i gotta be at the gym in the morning um, and plus I want to do a little bit more research and write some things down. It's 9:14 right now. I want to be asleep by 11. So I'll check in momentarily because yeah. Level is just so advanced. The bezel is tipping and scam. Don't grip on my hand. I know that I came with the slide from left to right, but now I don't want to dance. I got too much on the line, too much on my mind, too much ain't enough of my plans. Nike don't pay me to tell you, just do it. They pay me to show you I do it again. Huh? Yeah. I'm in control of the blood. Yeah. You know how poor we get hot. No. Let me make this glitz go pop. Hey. The grip is over the top. The whip is over the top. Oh. I thought about letting her go. Right I was 
I can't be pellin' my casket, make sure I die with a tan, it's part of the brand I know that I came with a slide from left to right, but now I don't wanna dance Can't I depend on a man, I slide some bread in the jam, that's just who I am Custom just waving at us from the window, they don't even come on the play when we land Anyone else will retire, but I'm not content I wanna bury these niggas like 20 feet down, so no one can find them again It's gotta be scary to witness me carry these niggas around in both of my hands They stay inviting me over, they say they got bitches, I get there and then it's just them Got rich from the boy that leaked, he sent me a new and said he's instead Everything good when he live in the house, got shit for me for bed Can you imagine the shit that I seen? I went from the road to South Point Blue, the bridge got burned and shattered I'm climbing, I don't need a ladder New year, it's a new chapter Start snap at Dave and Snapper She on the fuck out of anger Back in the days, life was so hard And pal, I'm trapped in backyards I didn't know about Boyard I didn't